Welcome to Synagogues of Israel, Part 38. This is our second look at the Jewish houses of worship in the Tiveria area. We thought this was an interesting one. It reads, Beit HaKnesset Abat Chinam. Google translated it as free love, but of course it really means unconditional love. The Hebrew words on the last line read, Otzer HaSforim, which could be also such as a library. This fancy-looking building is called Mikdash Shlomo, which in English is called Solomon's Temple. It's possible that it was dedicated to the name of someone called Shlomo, and not the son of King David. These are interior shots of the synagogue called Nof Kineret. In English, Nof would mean the view, or the view of the Kineret, which is the Hebrew for the Sea of Tiberias. Ironically, Nof Kineret is a location a couple of kilometers away from the Yam Kineret in an area called Rosh Pina. It's also called the Merkaz or the Central Synagogue. This unique looking building is called Beit Knesset. Shira le David Shalom, or a song to David of Peace. And finally, this synagogue is called Kehilat HaChasidim, or the Congregation of Hasidim. The sign indicates that it is named after one rabbi with the permission of a, another rabbi who is still living. This concludes our brief look at the Jewish houses of worship in the area of Tiberia in the country of Israel. We'll check out another area shortly. See you soon.